This is my butterfly plant that is going into dormancy. Eight days ago, this is what it looked like. The Oxalis triangularis is flowering and is very healthy. This plant naturally has a dormancy period. At this point, what we will do is to allow the plant to dry up and then we will save its bulb. I usually just leave the bulbs in a pot and then wait for it to grow, like this one. So today, we'll show you the growth of this Oxalis triangularis from day 0 to about day 74. So... I Just put it in a pot, small pot, with garden soil. Once it starts to grow, I placed it in an area where it can receive as much indirect sunlight as possible. And then I start to water it on a daily basis. This is our plant in day 34 or after more than a month. We'll just keep on watering this on a daily basis. After a week or two, our plant is starting to grow more and more leaves. As you can see, new plants have grown from the bulbs or the corm of the plant. Here, the leaves are still tiny. So we'll just allow it to grow more and as the plant grows, the leaves also becomes bigger. This is our plant after day 74 or that's more than 2 months. It has grown quite well. This plant will continue to grow until it is able to produce some flowers and the cycle continues. General care tips, I just usually plant my oxalis in garden soil and then I water it on a daily basis. It is placed in an area where it can get as much indirect sunlight as possible. I live in a tropical country which is the Philippines and my plant goes into dormancy at different times of the year. For this one it started to go dormant this September. I also had some plants that went dormant after it flowered in the summer so that's around May. So the dormancy period are different. I usually just leave the plant be and then it just grows back after a few months. That's it. We hope that you enjoyed this video and that you learned something. Stay safe and healthy and on our next video. Bye!